What's going on everyone? Back here out in the ocean, went out the Golden Gate Bridge, just out at like Stinson Beach, Duxbury area, Marin County coast, going for salmon today. Got a super special episode, so excited for this one. No introduction needed. Got Matt's from Fisherman's Life with me guys. What's up guys? Can you believe it? <laughs> We're out here. We're out here. That's right. If you guys have been watching me, I'm sure you're watching Matt's here. We've had one goal all year. Get a big salmon. Hasn't happened yet. What's your biggest of the year? On my boat, 22 pounds. My own personal, 17 pounds this year. Okay. So I've mine's 19 pounds this year on the boat. Haven't got a 20 pounder. Sounds like he's gotten a 22. Goal today, get like a 25 pounder, something big. We're into October now. These are big salmon. They're going up to Sacramento River to spawn. We're targeting those. Um, surreal being out here with them. I mean, this is the inspiration to my channel. Um, watching him for over the years. Uh, got into crab snaring, watching his videos. And here I am out here filming myself now. I can't believe it. With him. Awesome. I don't even know what to say. We're gonna have a great day. I can't wait to fish with him all day and talk to him. And He's using a herring. Yeah, using cable baiter. Cable baiter on the herring. And I'm, you guys know my rig, crippled anchovy, green flasher. So we're gonna start trolling and get the lines down and hope we can get some big ones today. That looks good right there, guys. Nice tight spin. You don't want it making big loops. Cable baiter. Have you ever fished on party boats for? That's like half the One time in my life. So, you know, so I got this where it just comes right out the mouth. And that's where you're going to put the nail. So I want that hook buried, so I'm going to put it in right down there. There's his, aunt, or his heron spinning. So we're about 80 feet of water. I got mine at 55 feet. Where are you going to put yours, you think? Uh, about 42. What a beautiful day out here. I mean, check this weather out. Look at that rainbow. Matt says we need to go that way. At the bottom of the rainbow, there's salmon. <laughs> we'll see. And the swell is two feet today, like 16 seconds. Wind, minimal, just a few miles per hour later. Probably been trolling 30, 40 minutes. No signs of them yet. Haven't seen any party boats or anyone drop a net. brought the line up uh, it's been about one hour now no signs of them for what we've seen from any boat try underwater cam drop it down uh, I feel like it attracts the fish we'll see hope we can get some good footage and a bite on it Looks like we went over some fish. Unfortunately, none of them got hooked. When I brought up the line, I noticed it was scratched. So one of them did bite it. Dude, I got bit. So it's just past 12 now. We keep working our way north. We haven't found any fish yet. Pretty disappointed. 
Uh, a lot of birds right here. We're excited about that. We've seen some, uh, a few fish caught, heard some on the radio. So still got some confidence. We're gonna be able to do this. All right, our first bite of the day. Woohoo! Ah! You kidding me? You kidding? <laughs> Yeah, I thought I felt or I thought I saw something again, right? Oh yeah, yeah, it went down. Like, yeah. Dude! <laughs> Six hours and we got a bite. Our first legit scratch day. Salmon are making us work hard. We're after three o'clock now. We started heading towards the Golden Gate Bridge again and found a bunch of party boats people work in this area so we'll drop down here try for another hour or so hopefully we can find one dude we got one First salmon of the day, folks. Finally, I'm waiting for this. Oh my God, there we go, we got him. Yeah, baby. We got something. Let's go. <laughs> All right, we got a fish. Woo. We worked hard for that one. Twenty-four incher. Yeah. All right, so happy we got one. It's four o'clock. Only took, I don't know, seven and a half hours of trolling to get one. <laughs> 24 incher. So, at least we're able to get one. <laughs> hopefully we have another hour left of fishing or so. Hopefully we can get one more. All right, we're gonna head in now. It's getting close to five o'clock. Man, we spent a lot of time out here today. Didn't get what we wanted. We're hoping for that big salmon. They're hiding from us. So people were catching them. Didn't happen. Matt, I want to thank you for coming out with me. Man, what a pleasure to be out here with you today. It was great getting to know you. So Good time. Yeah. Caught some fish. I mean, we weren't skunked. That's better than nothing. Yeah, hey, one of my goals was to net a fish this guy caught. I did that. Hey, not many people can say that, right? Yeah, we had three hookups, an eight-incher. A scratch bait and a 24 inch or so. Yeah, I'm happy. Exactly. Good day on the water. Going home with something. It was fun. Um, if you guys liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel for more. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Thank you. 
Okay, before we end here, can you guys believe it? I went out with Fisherman's Life and we caught one small salmon in eight hours. I mean, that's my worst salmon trip of the entire season. And it had to happen on this day. I wasn't feeling nervous. I was feeling confident. I thought we were going to get a big one. It just didn't happen for us. So the very next day, I go out with a regular of the channel, Eric, and we have an amazing time out there. What's supposed to happen for me with Fisherman's Life happened the next day. Man, the timing was off. So stay tuned for that video. I'm going to try and get out here real quick, and hopefully there's a next time with Fisherman's Life.